The IPCC is an organization that's responsible for assessing all aspects of climate change and we bring together the best scientists in the world and we function under the directions and guidance and decisions of all the governments of the world. So therefore what we provide is essentially uh, the best science which has a buy-in from all the governments of the world and to which all the governments are committed. And the reason why I think the IPCC is important is because, as Einstein said, solutions can't be found to problems at the same level of awareness that caused them. So what we are hoping is that through the assessment of science that the IPCC carries out, we'll also create a level of awareness by which this great challenge that we're facing in the field of climate change can be met effectively. The special report on renewable energy and uh, mitigation that we have brought out and completed uh, will certainly answer a growing interest in renewable energy worldwide. And uh, by carrying out a comprehensive assessment of all aspects of this particular area of activity, we provided a body of knowledge based on published literature from all over the world, which I think will help decision makers in defining how they can use renewable energy in their own future energy solutions. So I think this is really a monumental effort uh, that in some respects can make a revolutionary change in thinking as far as the use of renewable energy is concerned. And people would be better informed on the technology, the economics, the social dimensions of producing and using renewable energy which I think will provide a basis for enlightened uh, energy policies in the future. The assessments that IPCC carries out are all policy relevant, but we do not recommend policies. That is not our role. We don't provide anything that's policy prescriptive. There are two important things that I'd like to highlight. We have found, for instance, that renewable energy is perhaps one of the most effective means by which we can reduce the emissions of greenhouse gases. And secondly, the technical potential of renewable energy is so vast and so huge that nowhere in the foreseeable future can we see that as being a limiting factor for the extent to which we can use renewable energy. So I think humanity has an unlimited opportunity to use this resource, this bounty of nature, uh, which would produce not only solutions for mitigating the emissions of greenhouse gases, but also provide access to those communities which are far away from the grid as far as electricity is concerned and have no access to modern forms of energy and fuels.